Okay, let's look at the number three. So, let's see what three is. Up here, we have three footballs. One, two, three. So this is how three objects look like. Three footballs. And this is how you spell the number three. It's T-H-R-E-E. -E. And up here is how we write it. And so you will just come around this curve like this. And then come around like that. So we'll try it again. Around right here in the middle and then go around like that. We'll try it again. Around the curve in the middle and then around this bottom curve. And we'll try one more. Around and around. And so that's how you write the number three. Let's take a look at the number four. We have four apples. One, two, three, four. And you spell four. It's F-O-U-R. And this is how you write the number four. Go down, you go over, and then you come across like that. Down, over, and then you cross that one that went over. Go down, over, come down, and cross that one. And then we do it one more time. Down, over, and we come across. And that is the number four. So let's take a look at three and four, this time using the five frame. All right, so let me write the three again. Remember, that's how you write three. Okay, see, we have three soda cans. One, two, three. And I will put three counters in, one in each space in this five frame. So we have a counter here, here, and here. See? One, two, three. Three counters were placed within this five frame. Now let's look at the number four. Number four, remember we go down, over, and then we cross it like that. And we see it's one, two, three, four. Four light bulbs. So this is how four looks. And I'll place a counter in each space in this five frame. So we have a counter. See? One, two, three, four. So that's how four looks like. Moving on. All right. So we're going to do some writing. So remember three? It goes like this around the curve into the middle, and then you curve down here. Now let's write three. Here's the T. Here's the H. R. E and E. Let me fix. I'll fix the E's. I'm going to have to use a smaller, smaller size. 
E and E. And now for the number four. Remember four? You go down and over and cross. So that's number four. That's how you write the number four. And now let's write the letters. So it's the F O U R. The number four. Moving on, we're, for this one, we're going to count the objects and write the number. So, how many stars do you see here? One, two, three. Three stars. Now, remember how you write the number three? Curve. And then you do another curve. How many fish do we see? One, two, three, four. Now remember how we write the number four? We go down, we go over, and then we cross that. How many pencils do you see? One, two, three, four. So, Remember number four, down, over, and cross. How many scissors do you see? One, two, three. So write the number three. How many soccer balls do you see? One, two, three, four. So, I'm writing the number four. And finally, how many bottles of glues do you see? One, two, three. There we go. Now we're here on the blank page. And with this, what we have to do is to draw some pictures that represent the numbers in this lesson. So, up here I will draw three pictures. I'm going to draw three stick figures. Is the head, the legs, the arms, head, legs, and arms. So I have three stick figures, three little people. And that's how we write the number three. Now what else should I draw? To show the number four, I will draw four boxes. One, two, three, four. Four boxes, and this is how we write the number four. Well, that's it for the numbers three and four. Bye.